like to read a poem entitled Poema para los Californios Muertos. A plaque outside of a restaurant in Los Altos Arnia reads, Once a Refuge for Mexican Californios. die into stretches of freeway. The high scaffolding makes a clean cesarean across belly valleys and fertile dust. What a bastard child this city, lost in the llores de las madres. Californios moan like husbands of the raped, husbands de la tierra, tierra la madre. I run my fingers across brass plaque. Its cold stirs in me a memory of silver buckles and spent bullets, of embroidered shawls and dark rebozos. You recuerdo ellos, los antepasados muertos. Los recuerdo in mi sangre, mi sangre fecunda. you still live here somewhere in the shadows of these white high-class houses? Now at this restaurant nothing remains but this old oak in an ill-placed plaque. Yo soy sola sus hija pobre, pero ellas yo maldigo estas fantasmas blancas. Solo sus fantasmas deben aquí quedar solo sus. I see nothing but strangers. On the shelves there are bitter antiques, Yankee remnants, y estos no de los Californios. From outside I hear a shrill blue jay. I smell the pungent odor of crushed eucalyptus and the pure scent of rage, rage, rage. Welcome to our open studio presentation of Six Poets. We hope to keep you engrossed for the next 30 minutes or so while you watch some of the most diverse and uh, talented poets uh, recite for you some of their original works. My name is Javier Pacheco. I am a poet, musician, musico poeta, safado, etc. And I dabble in uh, poetry and music, or leave them both alone, whatever the common. I'm going to be doing Sigue Raza Sigue, La Vision, and Let Us Make a Stipulation, which is a poem about stipulators. My name is Ramon Piñero. I'm from originally from New York by way of Puerto Rico. I've been in the Bay Area for approximately five years. I've been writing poetry for about seven years. Uh, today on this program, I will try to express a hope for my people and they just struggle for their freedom. Uh, my poems are entitled Una Receta, A Recipe, Bosa, Butterfly, and Music is to the Spirit. 
My name is Lorna D. Cervantes. I'm 21 years old. I've been writing poetry since I was eight years old. I've lived in the Bay Area all of my life. For the past three years, I've been giving readings here in the Bay Area as well as in Mexico. I'm committed to my poetry in a very personal way. I feel like it's the center of my life. And as a poet, I strive for honesty and directness. I'll be reading two poems along with my brother Steve, who'll be playing guitar and flute, and also one poem that he's written himself. Hello. My name is Steven Luis Cervantes. I'm 24, and I'm from the Bay Area, and I'm mostly involved in playing music and writing. And I've um, played, um, oh no, I've played for, um, for many benefits for the farm workers and for many cultural centers among the Chicano, Asian, and Black. I've also produced my own community radio programs. And during this presentation, I will play a guitar and flute, accompany these other people, my friends. And I will also, Lorna will also read a poem I wrote called, It's the Way You Do It. I'm Christine Coakney, and I'm here as a poetess who is committed to the task of educating the black nation of its worth. I have been performing poetry for the past six years with the Nairobi Messengers of Nairobi College in East Palo. I am now the authoress of Survival Tactics, which is a collection of my work with illustrations by Ms. Yvonne Brown, and it's also published by Zika Wuna Communications Company. And my name is Jose Antonio Burciaga. I'm originally from El Paso, Texas. I'm a graphic artist who has also been writing poetry for the past 15 years. Lately, I've had a lot more personal success with um, writing poetry, illustrating it, and reciting it. I'll be doing three poems. Two of them will be bicentennial celebrations. One is a bicentennial recipe by Berta Crocker. The next will be a uh, poem takeoff from the Midnight Ride of Paul Revere. It is entitled The Famous Ride of Pablo Ramirez. And the last one will be a litany in slang, Letania in Caló. Uh, Christine, I, I have a few questions to ask. Uh, your book, where, where is it available? Um, presently it's in Marcus or in here in San Francisco and also New Day here yes. in San Francisco. And, um